Welcome to Naptown Trading Cards, everybody. Today we have a wonderful selection of prison basketball. We have a cello pack, hanger pack, blaster box, and mega box. And we're going to be opening up everything, and we're going to see you know, how much we spent on the hanger pack, and how much we would make back on the hanger pack, and do that for all of them, and go ahead and see which ones I would buy again, which ones I recommend, just my opinion, and... Just having fun opening everything. So let's get started with the hanger pack. So, let's see. Pretty much all of them are gonna be very similar as far as as far as what you can get. Uh, so one of the ones that got for 75 years at the NBA. Let's see. Don't know. Penmanch. Okay, so we can get we could get some uh so starting off, Eric Bledsoe, Alec Burks, Trey Young, Danilo, Malachi Flynn, Joel Embiid, Ralph, Jordan Poole. We'll kind of go through most of these. We got got a lot of cards to go through today. Got a rookie rookie emergent, Jalen Johnson. Have a Paul George dominance. Malachi Flynn again, but it looks like green. Is that a Devin Booker silver? That's nice. Center's not the best, but still a nice looking card. And a Lonnie Walker, Clay Thompson, Justin Holiday, and a Sharif C Cooper. That is nice. So I'm going to go ahead and put these to the side, and we're going to go ahead and open everything, and then we'll then we'll go ahead and see, see what we got. So, let's see. Oh, that's uh, looks like this one's pretty much the same, pretty much the same as the hanger pack, but we do get the three red, white, and blue prism pack, which I love. It's one of my favorite, favorite looking cards. Starting off, Eric Bledsoe, Alec Burks, Trey Young. That I'm pretty sure that was the same as last pack, but let's see. We got an emergent rookie Joshua Primo, Isaiah Stewart Silver, Reggie Bullock, Cade Cunningham. That's a nice pull. Uh, Paul Pierce and Isaiah Todd. So not too bad. Not too bad for the cell pack. So moving on to the bonus pack. Got the three red, white, and blue. Starting off with the Giannis. That is a nice looking card. Boban. And Hakeem Olajuwon. Nice. That's that's some pretty good pulls. I really I really like those. Okay, let's go ahead and go to the blaster box. Let's see if we can get. Hope everyone had a wonderful Christmas and a happy new year. And looking forward to 2023 with you. Let's see. Before we open, let's see what we can get. So it looks like in the blaster box, uh, same figures, the NBA again, uh, some more penmanship, uh, a few numbered cards. Um, let's see. An NBA 75th logo, retail silver. So, you know, this, this is a good amount, but we'll go ahead and let's start. Looks like we got six packs and it's four cards per pack. 24 cards for the for the blaster. Let's see Jason Tatum. Amari Studemeyer. And all oh, that is nice. Jimmy Butler. 
That's a pretty card. That is a pretty cool looking card. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and sleep up this piece at the end. So we'll go ahead and get everything open first. Alonzo Ball, Damian Lillard, Purple TJ Warren. What do we got here? Rookie Jalen Suggs Instant Impact. Nice. Reggie Lewis, Daniel Thies, Justin Holiday, and a rookie emergent, Apirin Sangun. Hmm. I'll keep that over here. Yeah. Uh, halfway down, we have to go. Take a little peek. Okay. Colin Sexton, Shake Milton, Tobias Harris. And a Julius Randle dominance. Starting off with a rookie, Isaiah Livers, Derek White, RJ Barrett, Six for the Celtics, Peyton Pritchard. Okay, nice looking card. Not too bad, not too bad at all. The last one, fingers crossed. Let me get one of those same figures to the NBA. I pulled a few, but not not many. I think two or three maybe tops. Ennis Cantor, Kyle Anderson, oh a silver Clay Thompson. That's nice. That's beautiful. And a Larry Nance Jr. Wow. Pride. So far, I think. I think it's a tie for me right now. It's not a head-to-head, -head, but I, I'm I'm torn between the hanger pack and the the blaster box so far. But this will be the first first mega box I've opened of any product, so I'm excited to get into it. Let's see. And it looks like pretty much the same as the blaster box. It looks like. It's four silver prisms per box on average. So we'll go ahead and get into it. Let's see what we can get. Okay. So it looks like it's six packs. into it. Pack number one for the Mega Box. And definitely comment down below let me know some of your best pulls for any of the prison basketball this year. Oh wow, got a couple couple pinks in there. Nice. Got a Patrick Williams, James Wiseman. Looks like a blue Joel and Bead. Don't check that. Uh, let's see. Got a rookie. No, we got Harrison Barnes. Nice. Obi Toppin. Dwayne Bacon. Jason Williams. Rookie Dayron Sharp. And a David Robinson. Okay, not a bad start. Not a bad start at all. Let's see, we got five more packs. CJ McCollum, PJ Washington Jr. Looks like a rookie Bones Highland Emergent. No way. Oh, they had me for a second. They really had me for a second. Looks like a pink Eric Gordon. Wow. I thought I really did. <laughs> Derek Favors, Reggie Bullock, Joshua Primo rookie. Allen Iverson, and a silver Thaddeus, Thaddeus Young. Nice. And we've got two more packs to go. Looks like we got a silver in the back. Oh, there's... Let's see what we got. 
Larry Jackson Jr., LeBron James, pretty nice. Montrell's Harrell, nice. Wizards. There go. We got a Trey Man rookie instant impact. Patrick Beverly, pink ice. We got Lugens Dort, Eric Gordon, and a Darius Basley. Let's see, we got two cards left. We got a James Booknight, rookie, and a rookie Evan Mobley Silver. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Wow. Three more packs to go. Not too bad so far. Not too bad at all. No complaints here. Got a Bradley Beal. Davis Burtons, Cade Cunningham, Instant Impact, Clint Capella, Pink Ice, got a Gary Trent Jr., another Gary, Gary Payton, Hakeem Olajuwon, Trace McGrady, Tracy McGrady, and an Isaiah Jackson rookie. Let's see, two more packs to go. Brian Forbes, Chris Paul. There we go. 75 years of the NBA, Devin Booker. That is nice. That's what I'm talking about. Beautiful. Got a pink ice, Brandon Ingram, Clint Capella, Jalen Brunson. Ooh, Stephen Curry. Jimmy Butler, and a silver Trey Man rookie. That is a nice looking card. Beautiful. Last pack of the video. Let's see what we get. Got another silver back there. Uh, Monte Morris, Donovan Mitchell. Looks like a Luca. Look at Dantic. Global Reach. Got Jalen Brunson. Killed on Johnson. And a rookie Zaire Williamson Pink Ice. Drazen. Darius Garland. Oh. Anyeka. I'm so sorry if I butchered that. And nice silver to finish it off. Awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and pick pretty much the best, best possible cards from each, each pack. And we'll go ahead and I'll double check everything on eBay and come back to you guys with, you know, final numbers on everything. After double checking everything on eBay and seeing what we could get, let's go ahead and get started with the seller pack. So starting off with the Giannis, that one was going for about $6 ungraded but I believe up to like $50 graded for a PSA 10. So definitely gonna try and get that one graded at some point. Uh, Cade Cunningham was about $3. The Reggie Bullock was a dollar. And unfortunately for the Isaiah Stewart, couldn't find anything where it had actually sold. So unfortunately nothing, nothing for that one. So for the cello pack, Looking at about $10 that we would get back. And the cell packs sell for about $16 at Walmart. So you know, $15.89 or whatever it is. So pretty much you're down $6 on the cell pack. But all in all, not bad at all. Like I said, really love the red, white, and blue. And hard to beat, nice to be honest. And moving on to the hanger pack. So we had the Sharif. That was about 50 cents. Clay Thompson was about $1.25. Uh, I couldn't find anything for the Justin Holiday, unfortunately. Uh, Devin Booker was about $3, actually, which is good. And then the Jalen Johnson was about a dollar. So for the hanger pack, uh, after making back about $5.75, and they go for about $21. So you're down $15.25. At least for this one. And again, low caveat, all of these that I'm looking at for prices, 
R for ungraded, and it's only one, one, one of each. So, you know, one mega box, one blaster box. So definitely take it with a grain of salt, but this is just, just a fun way to look at it, you know? So just want to put that little, little caveat in there. Uh, moving on to the blaster box for the Larry Nance Jr. going for about a dollar. The Clay Thompson, about a dollar. Uh, Jimmy Butler, again, about a dollar. And the TJ Warren, unfortunately, couldn't find any where they had sold. There are a few listings, but, but no bids yet. And nothing sold in the past, so nothing for that one. And the blaster boxes, we made back, or we made about $3. And they cost around 30 so you know you're down about $27 for the blaster box. And on to the beautiful mega box. So this one, similar to the Giannis, but ungraded the Evan Mobley Silver was going for about $20. There was some for a little less. There was one for 100 which kind of blew my mind, but definitely gonna try and get this ungraded. Centering's pretty good, and corners look good, so as long as I don't mess it up, should be pretty nice. Uh, Trey Mann was about $2. Sarah Williams, about $3. Jalen Brunson, it's about $1.25. Brandon Ingram, about a dollar. Devin Booker, unfortunately, only $2. That that one surprised me. Don't know if it should, but it did. Uh, Cade Cunningham was about a dollar. And to finish it off, another Trey Mann, again, about a dollar. So, all in all, for the Mega Box. If we sold all of them, we make about thirty-one twenty-five, and the mega boxes sell for about sixty, so you're down about twenty-eight seventy-five. But, but still, I mean, that's that's not bad at all. Especially the Evan Mobley, that that pretty much was <laughs> was a big majority of it. But overall, it was a lot of fun to open all of these, and especially our first mega box. So that was that was really fun. Um, Definitely let me know in the comments down below which which of these which of these polls was your favorite. Um, you know, definitely think the Evan Mobley and the Giannis are definitely the top two. So let's see. Yeah, I can't think I don't think there's any I mean the Kate Cunningham, this one's pretty good too. We'll put that guy up there. Um, but definitely those are definitely the top three polls. And overall the cello pack, I would definitely get that again. I'd give that probably an eight, eight and a half out of ten, especially because it's you know it's sixteen bucks. If you can get it from Target, should be fifteen. But those are a lot of fun to open, and the red, white, and blue that's that's hard to beat. So I would definitely recommend those. Uh, and like I said, I'd probably give them an eight and a half out of ten. The hanger pack. That one, um, I'd probably pass on. I'll give that maybe a 6 out of 10, just because it's $21, and, I mean, I'd rather just get a solo pack, to be completely honest. So, unless I just had a really bad pack, I'd, I'd just rather save, you know, save the 5 6 bucks and just get a solo pack. Um, so, yeah, probably 6 out of 10. I would not, would not get those again, probably wouldn't recommend them. Uh, the blaster box, that, I don't know, that one I'm torn. I'll give it a solid 7, only because I feel like I got a pretty bad uh, pretty bad box, because I have gotten a, where is it? I have it somewhere, but I did get a, a patch from one of those, so... They're not terrible, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't stock up on them. That's for sure, especially for thirty dollars. That's, I'd rather just get two cello packs to be completely honest, um, or just wait and get the blaster box or the mega box. Sorry. So, the blaster box seven out of ten, probably not going to get another one. Um, so, yeah, not a bad product. If they have them. You could get one, but I wouldn't, I would not stock up on them by any means. And now onto the beautiful Mega Box. 
So that one, that one I would definitely recommend. Um, I'm not saying go out and buy all of them, but that one was a lot of fun to open. You get a bunch of cards. I'd rather get one Mega Box than two Blaster Boxes. Same price, and you get more cards, so, you know, that's really, that's really hard to beat. So I'd give that, honestly, probably a 9 out of 10. I know it's up there in price, but it's still under a dollar. Is it actually, wait, a little bit more than a dollar per card, but, you know, you're still, still getting a bunch of cards. It's a lot of fun to open, and, yeah, I mean, a little biased because I guess we got that in Mobley, but still, that one, that one I would definitely recommend. Uh, so the two I would definitely recommend, Mega Box and Cell Pack, would not recommend the Hanger Pack and Blaster Box, if you want to. I, I might get another one, but probably just save my money and get a Cell Pack or two. But definitely let me know down in the comments which one of the four you guys have gotten or would get again. And again, which which poll was your favorite from this video? So, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.